This is your boy Deontay Nails here, and today's video will be another YouTube news video. If you haven't already, check out the description. I'm doing a gift card giveaway. I'm going to uh, announce the winners of the first giveaway in the next couple of days, but I'll be doing every month. All you got to do to enter is subscribe to the channel, like the video, stay active. You can follow me on Twitter to increase your chances of winning. But into the video for today, for those of you who don't know, um, my account, this YouTube channel, um, actually got terminated a few days ago. And this is the email I got from YouTube, and it's basically saying that they like to inform me that I had um, been banned for repeated or severe violation of the community guidelines. And they, they said I got banned, and I, I was just really confused on that. And then um, I appealed it, and they said they reviewed my account, and that I, did, I wasn't breaking any terms of service, and that they're unsuspending my account. And I just don't understand why, what could have been the reason for my account being banned or terminated temporarily. If y'all got a, if y'all know anything about this happening to your channel or any other channels that you, of people that you know, put in the comment section why you, you think that that could have possibly happened. Into the second topic of today's video, it comes from Tiffany Punzel, that is Faze Clayster's, or is Clayster's ex-girlfriend. Um, she couple of days ago or about or a week ago I don't know how long it had been going on but it but she was cheating on him and Clayster found out and she posted on Twitter uh, yesterday and said I'm so sorry forgive me and then she posted this on Twitter I've always been up front about my depression and blah 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 and she started just like talking about how she she's become majorly majorly suicidal and that she wants to die and like that she's contacted people to understand and like just basically just like saying how depressed she is and she later goes goes on to say that she's cutting herself and that she really is feeling down and she's saying how the internet is awful and like people are just treating her so bad and and different things like that and that she's checking herself into a mental hospital uh, yeah, a health hospital, a behavioral, sorry, a behavioral health hospital so she can go back to normal. And I just, I mean, I, I personally, I feel bad because, like, as a person, I'm a good person. And, like, I don't want anyone to ever have to go through, like, being depressed and feeling like they're going to have to kill themselves because she was saying that she was cutting herself and that, like, she was just really, really depressed. Um, I, I totally understand her depression. I mean, I feel... Like, we, I feel like that people should understand that, but then again, there is that thing where she created this for herself by uh, cheating on someone who actually loved and cared about her, and she betrayed him, and I don't want her to feel like she needs to kill herself about it, but she should not just feel like, okay, she shouldn't be happy about what she did. Like, she hurt Clayster. Clayster could be the same way, if not worse mentally because he poured it like years into her and she just went and betrayed him in the biggest way that you can portray someone that you're in, in a uh intimate relationship with like that's just like i feel her i hope she gets help i hope she doesn't do any harm to any more harm to herself but she does need to know that what she did is wrong and that like it's not okay but uh let me know what y'all think about that in the comment section um, just let me know y'all thoughts and opinions on that in the comment section. And this this next topic comes from I think it's the last topic of today's video it comes from KSI. KSI was gone and un, un, unactive from all social media for a long time. He's seeming to come back. He's been posting on Twitter a lot. He's been um, p dropping songs, and he's talking like like he's been tweeting a lot um, in the past few days, and he's actually been uploading to YouTube. Um, he uploaded this video and he's just I feel like he's coming back. I think he's gonna come back to YouTube. He said on Twitter that he's dropping a new album. I think it's an album on June thirtieth. Or he's doing something on June thirtieth. So I mean I think he's gonna come back to YouTube. Um he's he's I think he's been taking time to focus on other things and YouTube's been full of bull crap for the past couple of weeks and months. So I think he's gonna come back now that YouTube's getting better and now that he's uh, wrapping up his um his his CD or his album, so thank y'all for watching. Let me know what y'all think about all these topics.
the uh, description or in the comment section. Let me know if y'all think KSI is going to come back. Let me know what y'all think about Tiffany Punzel's situation. And uh, let me know what you think about my YouTube channel being terminated and then unterminated. But uh, thank you for watching. Subscribe to the channel. Like the video. Check out my Twitters. They're on your screen. And uh, just thank you for all the support. My videos are starting to do really well. And um, I appreciate everyone who watches my videos. Thank you very much. Have a wonderful day. Peace out.